Welcome back. Gonzaga currently only has one scholarship left for next season, and it became apparent over the weekend that they are recruiting someone from the transfer portal for that final scholarly. That player is Wake Forest's Shondi Brown. I caught up with Demon Deacon Digest Les Johns to find out more about the next potential Zag. Shondi is the best. He's a good guy, good teammate. Uh, works hard in school. Yeah, he, he, he checks all the boxes. When you hear that, it's not hard to realize why Gonzaga is recruiting Shondi Brown. Then you hear about the physical attributes of the 6'5 guard who averaged 12.1 points and 6.5 rebounds during the 2019-2020 season. Shondi Brown is um, a physically gifted uh, athlete who um, has the ability uh, to put the ball on the court and get to the rim. Uh, pretty much any time he decides to. He's strong and athletic. He's uh, one of the most uh, physically fit uh, Wake Forest players I've seen. Les Johns mentioned in that last quote that Brown has the ability to get to the rim anytime he decides to be strong and athletic. That's the key for Brown to take his game to the next level, according to Johns. There are times that he waits for the game to come to him. He's uh, kind of a consummate teammate. And there are times he probably doesn't recognize just how physically dominant he can be. He's an 80% free throw shooter. So him driving to the bucket and getting to the line was a winning strategy, both for Sean D. Brown and for Wake Forest basketball. John said at the beginning of this piece that Sean D. checks all the boxes. In terms of what he is looking for, it seems like Gonzaga would check all the boxes for him. I talked to Sean D. just a couple days ago, and it seems like his, his decision-making process is purely trying to find the best spot for him socially, academically, and on the basketball court. Um, he wants a place where he can win. You know, he wants to be on a winning team. He wants to have a chance to play uh, for conference championships. He wants a chance to be able to, to play in the NCAA tournament. And obviously those things are probably lacking for him in the current environment Wake Forest. Shondi is currently choosing between LSU, Iowa State, Illinois, and Gonzaga. He technically would have to sit a year under NCAA rules right now, but he's hoping to get a waiver in order to play next year, considering that Wake Forest's head coach got fired.